But we got two more choices. We're going to choose Shell, and then we're going to go on to Wait. Wyatt? What? Wyatt? I don't even know how to pronounce that name, to be honest. I feel like a dumbass for that. <laughs> It's weird, it seems like everything's revolving around this entire restaurant. Wait. He's no, that's not that grandma there. Two hundred thirty six days in. Hey Shell, your sister's getting pretty good, huh? Becca had a good teacher, Steph. Thank you for doing that. She needs something to focus on besides, you know, everything else. Yeah. Growing up in a world like this, what do you think that does to a kid? Probably a lot. I'm trying to protect her from it as much as possible. Things are stable here, for now. I want her to grow up with this, not what's outside these walls. Becca's a good kid. These are shit times, and she's gonna go through that. But if we can keep her from experiencing some of the shit I've seen... But that's the thing, they gotta Thanks, experience Stephanie. that. They can't just live in a sheltered world. <laughs> they gotta learn to protect themselves. Thanks. Yeah, let's just clap! That doesn't seem I like a smart thing great. to do during the zombie apocalypse. Thanks, sis. You think we can do something like this every week? Uh... Do you... As long as, as long as it doesn't distract from keeping this place safe, that's always the priority. That was amazing, Becca. We could all use a little more music in our lives. Did I ever tell you that I used to play in a band? Yes, Roman, you've told us. She doesn't <laughs> want to hear about it again. All right, all right. In that case, let's get back to work. Oh, and thanks to Boyd's hard work on the vegetable garden, we're having fresh soup tonight. Nice. Okay, let's get to it. Fucking you love soup. You want to help me and Shell do the supply inspection? Cool. You check the flashlights this time. I'll look over the guns. Cool. Uh, yeah. Cool. Actually, I wanted to make sure our blades were in good condition first. No rush on the flashlights. Yeah, Shell, right. Get a sec. Meet me out back. Help me feed the watchdogs. Sure thing. They have watchdogs? That's pretty smart. Uh... Huh. Still one short. We never found the other flashlight? Nope. Still in the cornfield somewhere, I guess. Oh, fuck! No way! You serious? How are we doing on ammo? Better than we thought. We haven't had to use these for a while. What? Nothing. <laughs> you guys need help? Nah, we got this. Right, Becca? You go ahead and help Roman out back. Okay, I just want to take the a look at the photo. Pretty nice back then. That's because they used to pay people to clean it. Also, not as many dead visitors back then. <laughs> Empty it wall. Looks weird in here without the paintings. Well, Boyd wanted something to paint his own pictures on. I guess it'll be a personal gallery in here when he's done. Huh. I don't like this. It. It seems like every care or every one of these guys have like. Something that brings them together, like we I assume. On these, make sure they all work. Because the flashlights—the only thing I can remember the flashlights and probably one being lost—is during the the time where I accidentally killed Bonnie, because I thought it was one of them. Glad we thought to bottle our water before it ran out. Is this where I'm supposed to bring him or go meet him? Look at the shelf. It's starting to thin out in here. Thank God we have a garden now. Yeah, but that's only going to last for a little bit. Oh, shit! Oh, you scared me! He's hungry. I guess he knows it's feeding time. Oh, the watchdogs. It's disgusting. Can't disagree with you there. You know, uh, your sister said she wouldn't mind doing this. Roman, we've talked about this. Becca doesn't need to deal with this kind of thing. Listen, I know you think that giving her an easy life is what's best. But it's really not. 
This is far from an easy life, Roman. You know what I mean. She needs to know the sacrifices we have to make to survive in this world. As long as she knows how to protect herself, it's fine. I don't want her to stop caring about people. Okay. Nothing wrong with a little What's empathy. That one I don't know. I'll check it out. I gotta get back out front. Looking forward to that soup. <laughs> oh man, me too. That virtual soup. Talk to him? Whoa! I just want to talk to you, buddy. So what the heck is this? Like, seriously, what is this one eating? Because if we didn't feed it, it's definitely eating some sort of flesh. Oh, God. God. What the heck was it? Ugh. Oh, fuck, is that Granny? Oh my god, she turned. I'm going to go back inside. Yeah, see? Oh my god, I'm, I'm, the, all these guys, they're gonna run into one another again. <gasps> Fuck! <laughs> oh, Jesus, don't ever fucking do that again! Whoa, what's your problem? I fucking it's stabbed you! Time. You don't get all pissed off. <sighs> you just... You can't go jumping out at people. Not anymore. It's not safe. But... What if I had a weapon? I could have thought you were a walker. What are you talking about? I... Look, I... I just saw our walkers out back eating a puppy. Oh, is that a what puppy? that was? Yeah. I guess it just got to me. You know, it was... It was so little. You don't think about babies anymore, but... After a while, you just kind of accept this is it. Yeah. I guess you kind of forget. <laughs> right? But then, you know, there it is. You see it, and you want to protect it, and... And now it's gone. That sucks. Maybe if Clive dies next, we can put him out there instead. He'd make a better <laughs> what watchdog the fuck? anyway. She's so Becca. morbid. Shell, Becca, something's going on outside. What is it? I don't know. Something bad. We gotta find Roman. What the heck is going on? Come here, everyone. Shit. Come on, we gotta find Roman. This month, it's so good to be there. Jesus. Largum. L My God, L Largum. what did you do? All I did was put on the blindfold and bind his wrists. Somebody else beat him up. He already had the cuts and bruises. Watchdogs caught him trying to steal supplies. Is he bitten? No, they didn't get that close. Dude. Who is he? I got no idea. I don't think he speaks English. I can't believe he just snuck in. second break-in we've had in the last couple of weeks. Last time we couldn't catch him. And they got away with more medicine than we could afford to lose. Well, we all know what it's like trying to survive out there. He just came in here for food. Let's just give him some and send him on but his what way. What if there are more of them? That's just gonna send a bad message, out. though. That's right. He could be part of a larger group. If there were more, I think we would have seen them by now. Oh my I mean, God. nobody travels alone you by choice. Can show him how to get in? I feel like we can't just choose. let him go. It's too choice. dangerous. Who knows if he has friends waiting to attack? Exactly. Don't you think we would have seen someone by now? At least trying to negotiate to get him back. How? He doesn't speak English. You don't know that. It does make sense, though. Well, he's not staying here. You let in a stranger, and everything starts breaking down. The last time we did that, we lost Bree. And then Vernon with that goddamn boat. Vernon and the boat are the reason the group fell apart. Not trusting strangers. He made us beat up that guy with the mustache and steal his boat. We did that. I've regretted it ever since. That's when our group fell apart. He can't stay here. I agree. Keeping him here is not an option. In his condition, he'd be a drain on our resources. Look, we all know what we're talking about here, so let's stop dancing around it. We either let this guy go and take our chances, or we kill him. Oh my god. 
Oh my god. <laughs> You're right. <sighs> it's gotta be one or the other. I know Beck is gonna remember that. We're letting him go. It's the only right thing to do. I'm telling you, we can't do that. But killing him? Is that really the answer? Stephanie, Boyd, you two don't think we should kill him. We know where Joyce and Clive stand on the subject. You're the swing vote here, Shell. Oh, What's it gonna be? Fuck. See, I don't trust him just because... God, I'm a bad person. We can't take the risk. We kill him. There's gotta be another way. Tell me, what if he comes back? With weapons or, See, exactly. or a gang? Is it worth losing any one of us? Oh my god. Jesus. There really is no other choice, is there? We can't keep him here. We can't let him go. If there's even a chance of him coming back, or telling folks that might try to hurt us, we can't risk it. I won't ask you to watch. But if we do this, we're all in it together. If this ever happens again, it's gonna be one of you pulling that trigger. Oh my god. Dude, just don't watch back up! Do you have any fours? Go fish. Nope. Do you have any sevens? Totally have a seven. <sighs> yep. I miss playing guitar for everyone. It was stupid, but fun. Why don't we do that anymore? After we had to kill that guy, there's a lot we don't do anymore. I wish things were still like they used to be. Well, Roman's too focused on making sure no one's able to break in again. You know that's impossible, right? Well, after last time, Roman isn't taking any chances. Then he should fix the loose board behind the storage lots. Becca, are you sneaking out again? What? Oh, God, do you know how dangerous that is? It's not dangerous. There's nothing out there but slow-ass walkers. What are you talking about? We've had two break-ins already. Anyone could be out there. What if someone sees you and, and follows you back here? They won't. How the fuck do Damn you know that? that? Shell, I need to talk to you. It's open. What's going on? Hey, Becca. Hey. When you uh, get a sec, I need you to come out and talk to me. It's important. Okay. I'll be outside. You'll see me. Oh, God. We can talk here. No. Just finish up here and come find me. And don't take too long. What, what the hell is that, that all about? about? Oh. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Probably not good, though. Stay here. It'll be just a minute. I'll fill you in when I get back. I shouldn't have made that decision. Everyone looks so sad. Wait. Oh, was that... Is that where we killed the guy? It looks like it. Oh, we shouldn't have done it. We really shouldn't have done it. Yep. But I really don't see another option. Like... We can't trust anyone. It's the fucking apocalypse, man. The end of the world. You can easily hey. bring people back. Shell, it's Stephanie. What? Roman's got her locked up like some kind of animal. Whoa. They said she was trying to escape. They actually used that word. Escape. Boyd, calm down. I knew something like this was going to happen, Shell. I said if we killed that man, we were heading down a dangerous path. And now look where we are. I'm gonna go talk to Roman. No. No, just take Becca and get out of here. You know I can't do that. Things are good here. We just have to stick together and follow the rules. Just don't do anything stupid. See, I knew it. I knew it. Oh, that's the painting that he's talk they were we were talking about. Looks nice, Boyd. Thanks. <laughs> Going from harsh to to just saying your painting's good. 
Alright, let's see what Joyce has to say. Hey, I heard about Stephanie. Why did she have to do that? We're safe here. There's no reason to want to leave. I'm sure she had her reasons. I'll go talk to Roman. We'll figure it out. Oh, God. Now, what if I swing my decision the other way? They're probably gonna, like, get mad at... Oh, is she really locked Roman? in there? Good, you're here. I heard about Stephanie. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? You know what we do. What happened? We caught her trying to escape. Well, so what, Roman? Ever since the incident, this hasn't been an easy place to live in. If she doesn't want to stay, let her take her chances out there. Well, A, she had most of our seeds, medicine, and ammo with her. And B, you know we can't let anyone leave who knows where we are. She's screwed okay, that's us, a bit too All irrational. of us. And now we're in that position again where we can't keep her here and we can't let her go. You this is a completely this, different right? situation. No. The last time we did this, we agreed that next time it would fall to someone else. I'm asking you to do it. It's she didn't try and break in. But she's one of us. Th this is different. No, she's not. Not anymore. When she tried to sneak out and leave us without any medicine or extra ammo, she knew that could mean the death of any one of us. You got your gun? I'm not doing it. Fuck that. It's in the camper. I'll give you a few minutes to get your head together. Is there uh, no way I could have tried to swing out. his decision? That's up to you. Whatever you say, I'll back you up. Oh, that was a really weird time to drop the music. <laughs> Shell? What's wrong? Am I in trouble? No. No, no. Oh, I shouldn't have said it's not Stephanie. to escape. She stole a bunch of supplies and tried to escape. Oh my god. What the hell did she do that for? Roman says we have to... Kill her? Yeah. Why would she do this to us? <sighs> She's just scared. She made a mistake. That'll be our last mistake. Becca, Stephanie is your friend. Was my friend. Roman wants me to do it. I'm sorry. Let's just get it over with. Your gun's over there. In the drawer. Oh my god. Let's grab the keys. Can we take this camper? You know, we don't have to do this. We can just go. What? We've survived on our own before. If we just go, we can be out of here before anyone can do anything about it. Are you crazy? Where would we go? There's nothing out there. As long as we're here, we're safe. The group will protect us. But for how long? I don't know. Longer than we'd survive out there. Well, what if Besides, you escape? What if you, you know quote unquote rules. escape, Becca? If we try to leave, Roman will hunt us down. We don't have a choice. This is who we are now. Fucking right, we have a choice? I kill Roman. I don't want this to be who we are. Just let me do it then. No, no, no. No, I'll do it. You shouldn't ever have to do something like this. I just need a second. This really sucks. Yeah, it does. Shell, it's time. Oh, fuck it. What are you doing? Shell? Shell, what the hell? Sit down. Get safe. Shell! Hey! Shell! Are we safe? Oh, oh, shell. Shell. What the fuck? Oh, oh, oh. God damn it! Oh, fuck that. I'm not killing her. A completely different situation. I'm telling you. I know she tried to steal some stuff, but she also helped out. And she did not try and break in. And, oh my god. I guess we're choosing 
Wyatt Watt? Fuck, I don't even know how to pronounce that name. It's pissing me off.